Well, today, law enforcement and people across East Tennessee are remembering a 27 year old volunteer fireman, Roy Sewell. He died on duty responding to an ATV accident this week. Our Jared Austin shares the legacy he's leaving behind. It just shows what what kind of brotherhood that we have. Law enforcement from across the state are in Claiborne County to honor Roy Sewell. We've suffered a great loss as a firefighter community and uh, prayers for his family. Dozens of fire trucks, hundreds of firefighters, and several from this Claiborne County community are lining Highway 33 in New Tazewell as Roy Sewell goes for his final ride. Sewell died after running off the road in his fire truck. The lives that Roy has touched uh, speaks volume today. Whenever a call came in, the North Taswell Fire Chief says Roy always seemed to be there. And he did it without question, without a thought or moments or second guess. He just, he was there all the time. So his last ride marks his final goodbye to this East Tennessee community. We will get through it. And a day full of hugs and support for each other. Love each other, work through it, and go forward. In Claiborne County, Jared Austin, WVLT News. He leaves behind his wife, Randy, and two-year-old Delta. Their family is expecting a baby boy named Everett in a couple of months.